Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and in today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you can get all of these checkerboard outfits. Also, before we do begin, I just want to let you guys know I'm doing a giveaway at 50k subscribers. So if you want to, go down below and hit that subscribe button and it will help out a lot. Also, we are aiming for 800 likes on this video. So if you could go down below and hit that like button, it will be much appreciated. Anyway, shout out to these people on screen now for commenting hashtag TJRH on my last video. So guys, before we begin, a quick word from our sponsor, Digizani. They offer cheap, fast and reliable cash and rank services. They also do modded accounts, so if you want to check them out, there will be a link in the description. Also, don't forget, you can use my code TJRH for 5% off your order. Anyway, with all that being said, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing you want to do is you want to come to any clothing store on the map. And you also want to put the required amount of money inside of your bank. Now what you want to do is you want to equip the outfit you would like to save as it does delete all your saved outfits by doing this. Now you can either delete all your saved outfits yourself or just do the glitch and by doing the glitch it does delete them no matter what. And then what you want to do is open your pause menu then go to online swap character. Also for this to work you will need your main character to be in the first slot and it will also need to be a male or else it will not work for you. And now you want to make a new female character on the right slot. Now you want to make sure you do accept this alert as some of the clothing does require a high level. Anyway once you're in this menu you want to set this to a female and then name it anything. And once you do end up taking this picture, you will load into a public session. So once you have loaded into your session, you just want to open your interaction menu. And you want to enable passive mode so no one can mess you up whilst you're doing a glitch. Now you just want to open your pause menu to check if you have any clothing stores. If you do, you just want to go to one, but if you do not, just find a new session and they should appear. So once you've made it to a clothing store, just head straight inside. Now you want to go to the accessories menu at the back of the store. Now you just want to remove any accessories that do come with your outfit, so most standard outfits do come with earrings, so just make sure you take those off. Now you want to go down to your gloves and you want to equip the light woodland tactical. So once you've equipped those you want to head over to the shoe section, just over here, on shoes and you want to go onto boots, and you want to equip the ash winter boots. Yeah so it should be these ones here, number 77, and once you have equipped those head over to the pants section. Now you want to go into jeans and you want to equip the black cropped jeans. So these ones here, number 38. So once you have equipped these, you want to turn around and go into the top section. Now go into off shoulder tops. Now on off shoulder tops, you want to equip the salmon striped top. So yeah, this one here. And once you have equipped this, you want to go to the front desk and save this outfit. Now you want to make sure you save it to slot 2. Also this first checkerboard outfit is made up of two outfits so you want to name them 1 and 2 at the end of each outfit when you go to save them as it will help you out later in the glitch. Anyway for the second outfit you want to keep everything on and go on to tops. Then go down to sports jackets and you want to equip number 99 which should be the sea green puffer jacket. Yeah so this one here just equip this one and once you have equipped it you want to go to bust ears. Now on bustiers you want to equip the teal lace bustier. Yeah so it should be this one and once you have equipped this one you want to head over to the accessories menu. Now go on to necklaces and you want to equip number 11. Yeah so it should be this one and once you've equipped this go to the hat section. Now once you're on hats, go onto canvas hats and you want to equip the one second to last. So it should be number 78 and once you have equipped that you want to go to the glasses section just over here. Now on glasses go to casual glasses and you want to equip number 22. So it should be these ones here, the copper marbles. Now just go save this outfit. So you want to save this outfit to slot 3 just next to the outfit in slot 2. 
Now, this time, you want to name it the same as the first one, except for, instead of the one, you want to make it a two at the end. And this will make it a lot easier for you later in the glitch. So, these are the two outfits that make up the first checkered outfit. So, just make sure they are the same as mine. Anyway, moving on to the next checkerboard outfit, this next one only consists of one outfit. So, all we have to do is we want to go into the top section. Now, make sure you do take off your jacket. Then, once you do that, you want to go to bustiers. And you want to equip the camo bustier, which should be number 30. So, it should be this one. And now, everything else on the outfit is the same, so we do not need to change anything else. So, what you want to do from here is just go to the front desk and save the outfit. So, you want to save this outfit to slot 4. So make sure you're saving all these outfits in order, or else it will confuse you in the glitch later. So just make sure everything on your outfit is the same as this outfit here. So if it isn't, you want to just change it to whatever is on this outfit, as if you don't, uh, you will not end up with the same outfit. But anyway, for the next outfit, you want to go to tops, and you want to go down to sports tops. So on sports tops, you want to equip number 23. Then once you have equipped this one, all you want to do is just take off your hat and your glasses and then go save the outfit. So once again, you want to make sure you're saving these outfits in order. So you want to save this one to slot 5, which should be uh, next to your last outfit. Yeah, so this outfit does also consist of two, so you want to name it the same as I do, with that one at the end. So just make sure to check that your outfit is the same as this one. Anyway, for the second outfit, you want to go to the top section once again. So just go on to work jackets now, and you want to go to peach camo closed field, and equip this one. Then from here, you want to go to gun running t-shirts. And you want to equip the blue digital t-shirt. So once you have this equipped, you want to head over to the hat section. Now go on to canvas hats and you want to equip the one second to the last. Then once you have equipped this one, you want to go to the glasses section near the front. So once you're on this menu, you go on to casual glasses and you want to equip number 22. So these ones. Now, once you've equipped these, go to the front desk and save this outfit. So, save this outfit to slot 6 next to your first one. And also, you want to make sure you put a number 2 at the end of this. So, just make sure you keep all of these outfits in order so you don't get confused. So, basically, just watch what I'm doing and copy exactly what I do. So, just check both your outfits are the same as mine. Anyway, for this final checkered outfit, you first want to go to the top section. Now go down to sports tops and you want to equip number 23, which should be the same one as from earlier. So once you've equipped that sports top, you want to take off your jacket and then just head over to the pants section. Now on pants, go down to sports pants and you want to equip the ash roll ups. Yeah, so it should be these ones here. And yeah, once you've equipped these, you want to take off your hat and glasses. And then go to the front desk and save this outfit. So you just want to save this outfit to slot 7. And of course put one at the end of this as there is going to be a second outfit for this checkerboard one. Yeah so if you don't want to get confused later in the glitch make sure you name them the same thing as I do. And it will be a lot easier. So for this next outfit you want to go back over to the top section. Now go down to sports jackets, and you want to equip number 99, which should be the sea green puffer jacket. Yeah, so it should be this one. And once you've equipped this, you want to go to bustiers. And on bustiers, you want to equip the teal lace bustier. Yeah, so it should be this here, and once you've equipped the teal lace bustier, you want to go to the accessories menu. Now go down to necklaces, and on necklaces you want to equip number 11, which should be the same one as the outfit from earlier. 
So this component is for the checkered bow tie. So if you do not want the checkered bow tie, you do not have to equip that one. But anyway, what you want to do from here is go to hats, go to canvas hats and equip this one once again. And this component is for the checkered bucket hat. And from here you want to go to glasses and you want to equip the same ones as from earlier. So casual glasses and equip copper marbles. So these are for the checkered glasses. And once you've equipped these, go and save the outfit. So save this outfit to slot 8, just next to the first outfit for this one. And of course, as this is the second outfit for this, you want to name it with a 2 at the end. Anyway, that should be all the outfits complete, so make sure you do have them in order, just like I do. And just check every single outfit has the same stuff on as my outfits. So once you have made sure your outfits are the same, what you want to do is open your interaction menu and take the easy way out. This is so it forces the game to fully save. So once you do spawn out on foot, you want to open your pause menu, go to online and start up creator. Now once you're in this menu, you want to make a new land race. Now you want to fill in the details so the title, description and photo do not matter and can just be anything. Anyway this part here is important, you want to set the maximum players to 3 and also set the route type to point to point. And if you want to make this process a little bit quicker, make sure you choose a supercar. And now just teleport to the airport. Now you want to just place this trigger anywhere and take a photo of anything for the lobby camera. Anyway, this part here is important. You want to make sure you place checkpoints until the race is at least one mile long, as if it isn't, it will not allow you to test it. Yeah, so once you've made it at least one mile, just test it. Now, once you've completed it, you should get this alert. And you just want to accept this alert. Now, open your pause menu, go to online and go to choose character. So once you're here, you want to delete your female character. So this part here is important, you don't want to go straight into online, you want to return to story mode. So B for Xbox or Circle for PS4. Now from here you want to start up an online invite only session. So you should spawn in with the outfit you chose to keep and from here you want to go to a clothing store and save this outfit. So you want to save this outfit to slot 20. Now you should also see that all the outfits from the female have transferred over. So we're going to be doing the first checkable outfit first, which consists of two, so we're going to be merging them in Crooked Cop. So what you want to do is you want to go to biker suits, and you want to equip the black biker suit. So this is for the black gloves, but if you do not want the biker gloves, you can just equip any gloves you want to. You'll also need an earpiece for the next part, so if you do not have one, you can purchase one from Ammunition. Now you want to open your pause menu, go to jobs, play jobs, rockstar created and you want to go to verses and start up crooked cop. Now we're going to be doing this for every outfit so you want to set the clothing to player owned and then you want to invite anyone to start up the mission. 
So once you're in this menu, you want to go down to owned outfit and scroll two to the right and you should get this outfit. And from here, you want to ready up. So once you load into the mission, you want to equip your earpiece. And once you've equipped your earpiece, you want to go down to the clothing store in the mission so you spawn outside closer to the clothing store. Now just check your earpiece is still equipped and then you just want to exit the job by using your phone. Now if you want to before saving it you can remove your earpiece but you do not have to you can just keep it on if you want. And now go to the front desk and save the outfit. So what you need to do is you need to save these outfits in the last few slots. Then once we have finished making them all, you can feel free to move them all about. Anyway, once you have saved this outfit, you need to delete the two outfits you used to make this outfit. So you need to delete these two ones here. So for the next checkerboard outfit, you want to equip the black biker suit. Then once again, you want to go into crooked cop. Now set the clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start the job. So on this menu go down to owned outfit and this time you want to scroll only one to the right. Now just equip your earpiece and then go to the clothing store. Now just check your earpiece is still equipped and then just quit the job by using your phone. So once you spawn in you just want to go to a clothing store. Now you want to also save this outfit in one of the last few slots. Now you want to delete the outfit you used to make this one. Yeah, so for the next outfit, we're going to be equipping the black biker suit again and also going into Crooked Cop once again. Now just set the clothing to player owned and then invite anyone and start it up. Now this time on owned outfit you want to scroll 2 to the right and you should get this outfit. Now just ready up. So once you've loaded in just equip your earpiece and then make your way to the clothing store. Now guys from here make sure your earpiece is still equipped and then you want to exit the job by using your phone. Now you also want to save this outfit in one of the last few slots. Now just delete the two outfits you did use to make this one. Now for the final outfit you also want to equip the black biker suit and then also go into crooked cop. Now just set the clothing to player owned and invite anyone to start it up. Now in this menu go down to owned outfit and scroll 2 to the right and you should get this outfit and now just ready up. So once you've spawned in you want to equip your earpiece and then go down to the clothing store.
Now you want to make sure your earpiece is still equipped and then just quit the job by using your phone. Now that is all the outfits fully complete so you can save this to any slot you want to and also you can delete the outfits you use to make this one. Anyway guys I hope you did enjoy all of these checkerboard outfits and let me know down below if you do want some more checkered outfits in the future or if you want different outfits then let me know down below. Don't forget if you are new here to subscribe and help me reach that goal of 50,000 subscribers and I will be doing a giveaway and also we're trying to aim for about 800 likes on this video so if we could hit that that will be much appreciated. And also if you did make it all the way until the end make sure you comment down below saying you made it until the end and I'll try my best to reply. But anyway, once again, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.